Hey guys, it's uh, Swamp Happy Outdoors here. Um, this video is going to be a little different. We're going to go over a new jacket I bought that I think is going to be absolutely amazing hunting season and I think all you will like it. Um, this jacket, I'm wearing it right now, it's an Oro jacket. Um, it's got a nice camouflage pattern. Uh, it's extremely warm. It's lightweight, it's very thin. Um, it's it's just a well-formed jacket. Uh, has a nice little pocket here to get something, you know, maybe game calls or uh, maybe just a quick snack or whatever uh, in the upper pocket. Um, the pockets are actually a little, they're not too loud pulling up or down. I can make them pretty quiet. Uh, um, it's kind of nice around the base. It does have adjustable straps here so I can adjust them the tension on the, on the bottom side. This jacket uh, has a lithium ion battery. Uh, it's here on the side. It's got a nice zipper that keeps it in place. Um, you just pull it out and recharge your battery. This thing's actually really cool because it has uh, LED lights on there so you can shake it up and see how much battery life you have left. I haven't charged this in probably a month and a half maybe. Not saying I've used it a lot because it's been warm here, but it holds a pretty good charge. So uh, just charge it up when you first get it, probably you know overnight or however long it takes to make all four lights light up, and then you're good to go. Um, put it back inside your jacket and zip it up. Uh, it holds charge about six to eight hours, uh, depending on your usage and what setting you have it on, of course. What I mean by the heat on is, is it has a button here to push to turn the heater on. So that one's the highest setting when it's red, and it gets hot. Um, you hit it again, that's the lowest setting, low heat, and that's still warm. And then that's medium heat. Um, it's got pretty deep pockets here on the side. So um, as you're sitting here with it on, it's heating up in the back. It seems like it heats up a little bit up front, and it just keeps your body, your core temperature up, and that's probably the most important thing. Um, it also has these sleeves, as you can see, it's made into it, so it keeps the heat close to the body. A lot of it doesn't escape out. Uh, this jacket is waterproof and windproof. It does have a hood on it as well. So I think all in all, with the hood on, um, the sleeves the way they are, the jacket is it's got a nice zippers to it. Um, they're not real janky or anything like that, and the nice Velcro on here. I think we're going to be extremely, I'm already feeling the heat. Wow. <laughs> so it doesn't take long to heat up. It's not one of those things that you're going to have to cut it on and wait for 45 minutes before you get the heat. I don't know, 40 to 45 seconds, it's starting to put out some serious heat. Um, I've worn this jacket a little bit this winter um, to work. It was in the 30s. I really never had to cut the heater on, but I did, and uh, I really enjoyed it walking around in parking lots and things like that. They make these in various types and they have them black with the lights on the outside. The hunting one is absolutely different. So they do consider the hunter with leaving that light on the inside instead of the outside. I think the one's more for business casual or the school or whatever, it does have the light on the outside. And that's what caught my attention and made me want to buy one myself. It was like, what are you wearing? But it's, it, it does keep the heat in and it does go way down. I'm about six foot one-ish and it goes way down so when you're sitting in a deer stand your jacket's not riding up and then your backside's cold or whatever you can be warm in the stand you can be comfortable in the stand and you can just really enjoy being in the stand i think a little more with this type of jacket so check them out um i think you'll really enjoy it they're about 130 bucks ish you can shop around and see where you can get them they have them on amazon their website there are a bunch of places but a bunch of people sell them but check them out and uh I believe you'll be impressed. Um, I'm going to do some more videos here soon. I do have uh, a backpack, a hiking backpack that I'm going to do a review on. Uh, low budget, but it looks like a really nice backpack. And I'm going to show you some of the things that I'm doing to it differently before I ever use it. Please like and subscribe. Check us out and uh, share us with everybody that you know. Thank you.